Believe it or not, we're in week four of the high school football season. This week's Friday Night Fever Game of the Week features two heavyweight programs poised to do battle in Amory. The undefeated Panthers host the hungry one and two New Albany Bulldogs. WTVA's Matt St. Jean was in Amory today to visit with the Panthers in today's scouting report. Rainy day here in Northeast Mississippi. The Amory Panthers are practicing inside today as they get ready for their Friday night matchup against the New Albany Bulldogs in our Friday night fever game of the week. The Amory Panthers are 3 and 0 for the first time since 1999. But they have a solid group of seniors who have navigated the coronavirus through the summer and through the start of this season and they've got 3 wins and they don't plan on losing this Friday. We had all been playing since freshman sophomore year, so we've been playing together for a while, even back to middle school. So like we all got pretty good chemistry together. Hunter Jones is the quarterback for the undefeated Amory Panthers. He's led the offense to an average of 37 points per game. Jones is making things look easy on paper, but the offseason was anything but. We got two games stripped from us early, and then everybody was like, well, are we going to get another two stripped, or are we going to get to play, or is there even going to be a season? So it was just hard to keep everybody's head on straight, but now we got a season, and everybody's where they need to be. But with the senior leadership, like from Jones and wideout Braxton Griffin, the Panthers didn't wait for the green light to get ready. Instead of waiting around, a lot of us got out and did a lot of workouts on our own just to get ready for football season because we missed out on a lot of workouts over the summer. For our head coach, Alan Glenn, having senior leadership like that has made it easier on him as a coach, and now the hard work is showing on the field. Uh, we've kind of had to put everything in warp speed, you know, there starting end of July, kind of getting ready for, for the season. So uh, it was good to have a, it's good to have a good group like that that's played a lot of football in the past that kind of knows the ins and outs of it. Uh, so that's we've been blessed with a good senior class. Tomorrow night we'll hear from the New Albany Bulldogs who are trying to get back to 500 after losing to Hernando last week. We'll hear from Coach Stubblefield and a few of the players about how they bounce back and how they plan to finish the season and take on the Amory Panthers this Friday. But for now, reporting in Amory, Matt St. Jean, WTVA 9 Sports.